Hey guys, Gamer of Gamers in the Zone, and welcome to another episode of Toho 11 Subterranean Animism. Last episode, we played through the game on normal with uh, Starnius Marisa Kurosame, and we had Alice Margatroyd as our uh, first ally. So this episode will be having Pacholi Knowledge as our next ally as Marisa for this episode. But once again, before we begin this episode, uh, once again we have another wonderful comment. This time it's not from Freezing Time, this time we have a comment from Alan K.O. who has commented, um, Mari A. has a low amount of iframes after bombing. That's where a lot of your deaths came from here. Also, Stage 5 is pretty difficult. There is a large amount of strats you can know for Stage 5 in this game, but I will only type them out if you want me to. It would be a very large paragraph. Mari A and Mari A are both good shots. Harder to play as than Remu A, for example. You are doing it pretty well, by the way. Subterranean Animism is probably the hardest ge Toho game for normal 1cc. Unless you play as Remu or Marisa in uh, Toho 15. Okay. Again, nice to know, and thank you once again for leaving, uh, everyone, for leaving comments in my videos. That being out of the way now, let's go ahead and begin with this episode. Now, uh, let me quick look at uh, some things for this episode before I begin. Uh, switch between your options, attack formation, so it's press shot, focus I mean, wait. Options, attack formation. Five formation types, a bunch of different elements. Okay. So, this is one of those super complex shot types then, if that's the case, because... I have not seen anything like this before, and I am probably going to be very confused. So, let's hop into it and see what we're in for this time. Oh, boy. Can't even tell... What, what we currently have equipped. Alright, dealing with that asteroids. Hmm. Or at least that's what it feels like. Feels like we're playing a game of asteroids. And quick head up here for a moment. And get back down, get back down. There we go, get him. Can't even tell. Okay. I see what the shot type's doing. I have no idea so far if this is going to be better or worse. Based off the five different options it was giving me, I feel like this is one of those super complex ones where you got to know which ones to use at the right times. That's what I'm guessing. Well, right now I d can't quite tell what I'm supposed to be doing, but I I I'm sure I'll figure it out. I mean, I always figure things out in these games eventually. Oh, oh, okay, I gotta pay more attention. Okay, ah, but... Already. Already we have to restart. I'll admit, it, it, I, it has been a ridiculously long time since I actually had trouble with the first stage in a video game. Uh, like, the long, farthest back that I can think of having trouble on the first level... Is I'd say like um, maybe back when I was at a younger age when I played like the original Super Mario Bros. And me being at a ridiculously young age didn't know how to sprint or jump. So when I'd always go for the first question mark box, I would always, um, the moment I would land, would get hit by the first Goomba in the game. To where I would, and somehow I wouldn't learn from that to where I'd just keep getting game over at the start of the game. Yeah, times where I had a hard time learning in video games, but I've um, improved a lot since then. Which is how I've managed to get up to this point and have the belief that I can handle this level of difficulty in video games. I mean, imagine me not knowing how to win in video games. Am I right? Alright. 
Uh, pick up the power. I gotta remember, I, I gotta stop going to the top of the screen so much in this game because there's pretty much no reason to if I can't get extra lives from points. The wind's pretty strong for the inside of a cave. That's because there's a great, that's because there's this great wind hole is here. Hmm, my ears are ringing. You can hear my voice, right? What's that? Where's your voice coming from? From all those little things around you. Oh, a human. How unusual. Are you going to the festival they're having down below? You look like it. Be careful. The underground yokai are nothing like us. What? They... What? They look about the same. Well, if you're gonna go, go or else go back. It'll be harder if I ha have to get involved. The yokai underground are bad for you. What? It's not like I'm going eat her. Yeah. I'm bad for you even if you don't eat me. Well, I haven't punished a human with diseases in a long time. I may as well have some fun. Oh, really? I okay, how did... Okay, does it depend on my power that this... Uh okay, I think I have to, like... Don't I have to, like, go back and forth? Okay. I, I get it now. I have to let go of both focus and the fire button to switch to the one that I want. I want the straightforward one so I can focus specifically on one target. That's where I see a shot type like this useful. Okay, so I gotta figure out which shot type will be the most useful in which situations. Okay, and I'm gonna have to get up here. Okay, why did I do that? Okay, no, 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 no. What does this do? Oh, it fires behind is what it does. No, I want the straightforward one. Is what I want. At the moment, oh. Okay, so I was... Uh, to prevent the me from switching, I just gotta hold down the fire button. So I'm sure there's probably uses for being able to fire behind and side by side like that. And I'm sure I'll eventually, as I continue playing, we'll figure out the best situations. Wow, you're right. She seems pretty bad for me. The underground is full of despised yokai. You better be ready for them. Is that why you don't come down here yourself? You sent me instead? That's not fair. Alright, next stage. Let's go. Okay, actually, let's switch to this shot type since we're dealing with regular fairies and not, like, any other enemies. This will be a much more useful shot type to go with. See, already I'm uh, getting some I good ideas. It is going to make enemies have more health a little tougher, but... Uh, still, though, I think widespread will be more useful when going up against normal enemies. I just got to know what I'm dealing with here. Okay, and then... There. That's the shot type I want. It's gonna be very hard going from, like, widespread back to the one that... Back to the straightforward. That is one thing that will probably make this a little bit hard for me. Okay, this is definitely an instance where I can tell... Yeah, I'm gonna, like... Want to have a... Like, switch up my shot types a little bit. Oh, can, can, can we just kill her? Please? I'm just taking her down. Uh, my focus is getting extra lives. I, I'm okay if I lose some power in the process. Well, as long as I don't lose all my power, that is. So, you okay underground are bad for me? It seems like the underground itself is pretty bad for me. I read up on that yokai we ran across before. It was an earth spider, a troublesome yokai who inflicts disease upon humans. Oh, that was a spider, the first stage boss? Again, another instance where these characters look nothing like what they actually are supposed to be. <laughs> disease? Give me a break. So you can tell what their weak points are too? Oh, you're a human. Have humans uh, come to explore the underground? Oh yes, that's exactly it. 
Please take my advice. You're better off just going right back where you came. I don't feel like going back, though. So what can you tell me about this one? What's her power or her weak point? Oh, sh should I know that already? Well, I tried to warn you. Humans are truly foolish. Uh, well, you're the one that provoked her. Deal with her yourself. Guess I have to. Well, please uh, look up how to beat her while I beat her, okay? I don't think that's how it works, Marisa. Alright, it is going to be a bit of a pain, though, every time I want to switch, like, between widespread and, like, back to the one that I want. Going to be quite hard. Okay, go up here for a moment so I can get out of this. Yes, yes, trail along the path. Or, maybe that was a bad idea. I just want her down as soon as possible. Alright, you're going down. See, I ha you know, I'll get the most out of my extra lives every time I get through a phase without having to resort to... Ah! Okay, I gotta be careful how close I stay around bullets here, because things are gonna get a bit messy if I hang around too much. Okay, I'm just gonna keep using up power. Oh. Ah! Okay. I, I think it'll be best that I hang underneath the one firing the smaller bullets and not the one firing the big ones. Yeah, that worked out a lot better. Now I'm running low on power. Alright, I still got a plan. I just gotta make sure that, uh... Hmm... Take that. Now this is an instance where I'd have to think a little bit carefully about the best way of going about this, because I could definitely see how it would be a bit troublesome to uh, just... Ah! Come on! Let me get in a firing position. Thank you. Looks like I beat her. A uh, person... A person driven by jealousy? I don't really... A Persian person driven by jealousy? I don't really understand. Why is a Persian underground? Yeah, they should be in the world of Pokemon. <laughs> Look, this is all conjecture. <laughs> hmm, why do I feel like I'm down here to conduct research on underground yokai? So that's the only good you're for, Marisa. Oh, is this the only elemental type I have access to while I'm only at low power? I think so. I better get myself some power if I'm going to stay in the game! Ah, uh, Always hits me when I least expect it. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, no, 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 no. Ah! Okay. Okay, again, widespread, very useful here. I see that. Alright. I see the usefulness of widespread here. Okay. 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 For now, I'm just gonna stay in widespread mode, since... It'll be a little bit tedious to go back. There we go. Hey, you're pretty good. I don't know who you are, but they say a rowdy welcome is best for a rowdy guest. Alright, let's go. Gotta take you out as quickly as possible, while at the same time, figuring out where to go next here. Ah! Still can't figure out the best path to go about this. Ah, okay, just keep using power is all I'm gonna do here, because... I don't know the best course of action. I like you. We'll have lots more fun, so keep following Ted Kinky. Oh, I really want to follow you, but... Too bad. Okay, focus on the power fairies. As if I can, as long as the streamers don't keep getting in my way. 
Which they kind of are starting to get in my way. Ah! Ah! They're too much in my way. Those streamer fairies. Man, what's with her? I read up on that, that yokai we ran across before. It was a bridge at Princess, a yokai driven insane by jealousy, sworn to protect the bridge. Hey, why not worry about this yokai that's here now instead? Read up on her, please. What? Are you out of breath? Giving up already? I can't conduct research that quickly. You're so useless. What's wrong? Are you trying to figure out who I am? Hey, you got it. You're pretty good. That's it. Now just tell me your weak point, please. <laughs> I'm one of the big four of the mountain. Yugi the Strong. My weak point is fried beans, obviously. Hmm. I wish they had all been this cooperative. Too bad I don't have any fried beans on me. Her weak point is fried beans? Fried beans? No way. So why did you come all the way down here? Huh, you know, I have no idea myself. This place isn't our destination. Hey, get rid of this pest so we can keep going. You're pretty violent. Yes, indeed. I love violent people. But if you're all talked, then you'll die here. I shall test your strength. Great, I'm out of power. In the middle of a fight where I could really use some power right now. Alright, for now all I can really do is just focus on hitting the boss. And that is if my attacks are even hitting the boss. I can't tell. Oh, 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 this, oh, oh. Okay, it's gonna be much harder to fit past these if, okay, 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 I am in desperate need of power if I'm going to get through this. Actually, his face is kind of easier with less power since I don't have to worry about them turning into the bubble bullets and coming after me. So, actually, this kind of makes it a little bit easier on me. I'm still very lacking in power, though. This still isn't quite enough for me to get out of this. Ah! Hurry up and focus on the boss. Thank you. Oh, that's right. This attack. I don't like this one. Ah! Stop. Ah! Oh! Please! Oh, oh, I got scared. Great, now I'm out of power. Please, can we just talk about this? I'm still out of power. I've got nothing left at this point. Except my extra lives. Ah! Oh! I'm gonna have to tear her away as quickly as possible if I want... Any chance of more extra lives? Ah! Please, get over to her. Oh. Okay, still no power, but... Oh. I'm in way too desperate of a need for power. Okay. Get in there. And then... Get ready. Go. Okay. Not sure how long this is going to take, considering the fact that I am still very lacking. There we go. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen at some point. Looks like that was a turning point to where it all went down. Hmm. Well done. I expected nothing less from someone who made it all the way down here on their own. Well, let's... Well, let's move on. Uh, let's just leave her alone. You know where we're supposed to go? I have no idea where we even are. This place is former hell. A prison at the yokai from above can't interfere with. You beat me. I'll lead you wherever you want if you wish. Okay, then please take us to wherever the person who's creating the geyser is. A geyser? Okay, why don't you try going to the palace of earth spirits up ahead? Might be hard for a human 
Well, it looks like you'll be strong enough. Just strong enough to beat you? That's nothing to write home about. Look at her. While she was fighting us and drinking, she didn't spill a drop of her sake. And she hates fried beans. You were just testing us, weren't you? Alright. The... Oh, do I still not have access to other shot types yet? Okay, now I should have access to other shot types, but that doesn't really matter now since I gotta focus on the mid-boss. Or, I guess, beginning boss in this case. Huh? Where are they? I can't tell. Okay, go to widespread. I don't know the exact elements, but I know this one's the widespread, the one I want. So the widespread will allow me to take out a wide variety of enemies across the screen. These are the ones I'm enjoying the most. It's the widespread and the, um... Oh yeah, these are very useful. This is very useful. Okay, go back to straightforward. So that's what we'll need the most of. Okay, we need to focus our attacks toward the mid-boss. I got scared. Come on. Four. Three. Thank you. Alright, take that. Now, uh, where's... Where's some more power? I gotta make sure I stay well-powered! Oh! That was close. Okay, I'm actually kind of liking this shot type because it actually gives me a... Unlike uh, where I have to select my shot type at the beginning of the game, I actually have a wide variety to choose from. The only annoying part I've experienced so far is having to switch between the ones that I want, which is of course this widespread one and the um, straightforward one. So I'm kind of liking this shot type so far. No, why did I do that? That was a huge mistake. Uh, weird mansion. The ground's so shiny, it's weird. I wonder, if the person that made the geyser is here. Oh yeah, what about the geyser? We have to stop it. Is that so? I really have no idea. Besides, there are only cats and fairies in this mansion. A visitor. Are you human? No, you wouldn't be able to get this far. Hmm, there she is. Looks like a member of the household. Uh, hurry up and ask her about the geyser. Um, excuse me, I want to ask you about the geyser. Geyser? You really want to know about that, huh? It seems there's almost no information in your heart about the geyser. What are you saying? Wait a moment. I have a bad feeling about this. Who are you? I'm Satori, the master of this household. Eh? You seem human. What ne need do you have of me? Well, you know, the guys are... What do I... What do I do now? Ask her how to stop the geyser. But I don't really want to stop it. Well, is there any way I can? How to stop the geyser, you say? I'm sure one of my pets would be able to do that. Hmm. I want to meet with her and have her m make more hot springs. Eh? What? How did she figure out? How did she figure out what, uh, what I was thinking? You say, Marisa? She's more than you can handle. Hurry up and find her pet. I didn't give you permission to do that. Just how do you intend to go find her? Huh? I'll just find her somehow. This sucks. Maybe I should have asked. Her how I can beat this creep. Hey, how can you tell what I'm thinking? Satori, I've heard of those before. They're said to be the most hated of the yokai underground. What, people don't like mind readers? The yokai that can read your heart. They can use their power to control the wordless spirits. And only wordless animals love them. The animals grow up to become powerful yokai. Well, what's the matter? Aren't you off to the geyser? 
I don't feel comfortable with someone who can read my mind around. I can see it. My mind reading third eye will show me your very heart. The beautiful Don Mako in your heart will make you suffer. Okay, come on. There we go, straight forward! Ah! Uh, see what I mean? This is the only annoying... See, this is the only minor issue I've found with this shot type so far. It's the fact that uh, sometimes me trying to switch between the different shot types causes me to uh, forget about, um, you know, dodging the bullets. And that's one thing that can be a little bit annoying. That's the only issue I've encountered so far with this shot type. Other than that, I see it. That I was moving there. How did I get hit? I was on the move the whole time. I don't care what anyone tells me in the comments there. I was on the move. Alright, let's go. Now this is where it really begins. Go sleep with the memory of fear so frightful it'll wake you up. Alright, let's go. Alright, I think as long as I hold down the shift key during these conversations, it'll prevent me from going to a... Um, something I don't want. Okay. I don't see how this represents fear. This looks like a fairly simple shot type. Trust me, I dealt with something harder than this with, like, the attack frog. I have experienced worse. So, oh yeah, because at the beginning it said I had to let go of both the shift and the fire button in order to switch between the different attack types. So, I think that's how this works. Okay. I don't re fully understand what I'm doing or how this works, but um, I, I'm figuring it out. Ah! Uh, would it be more useful? Let's go with widespread for the rest of this attack, because I think it'll be more useful to have widespread. There we go. That's the one I want. Okay, what is this? I don't remember Patcholi having these attacks. I remember a lot of her attacks were much simpler than this. It's probably from like another spin-off game that I don't know about or haven't played yet. Alright, once you memorize a pattern, it can become fairly simple that was close hmm, you're quite strong it's good to attack humans now I'd like you to take us to that pet you mentioned before very well however I haven't seen this particular pet in quite some time so I don't know if uh, the, uh, what sort of yokai she's grown up to be what kind of master are you it pisses me off how many irresponsible pet owners there are these days my pets take care of themselves by absorbing various spirits and yokai. Letting them run free is the best way to keep my stress down. In other words, this person, th this yokai probably doesn't like having pets. That cat we met before was probably running free, just like our cat. Huh? You have a cat? Maybe that was a human we had. It's with the margin of error. Well, I'll take you to the courtyard. There's a hole there that leads to the deepest parts of the underground. Heading down again. Alright, let's see here. Let's see if... I'm stuck with this again. Alright, here we go. Time for my brain to get fried again. So this is always the stage where the difficulty just uh, goes into maximum overdrive. So let's hurry up and get my hands on some more power. I... There we go. This is the widespread one I wanted. Ah! And I'm probably immediately going to have to get rid of it in a moment. Because things are already going very downhill. Though, how am I so... Okay, yep, there it goes. I'm out of power again. I'll get that last power up. I need power. We got power. Oh. Oh, no. That ain't right. Okay, pick up some power. 
Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Just... Hang on. Just keep moving. Or, or... Okay, but don't move around too much, Marisa. Okay? Yeah, this is always where things start going downhill. No matter how many extra lives I have, I knew this would be the turning point where... I'm, I'm doomed to get game over. No matter how well I'm doing. Alright, let's stick to widespread here so I can focus more on avoiding the bullet... Oh, or just do that, sure. But I'll stick to widespread here so I can focus less on avoiding... Uh, on hitting the boss and more on avoiding the bullets. That may... Okay, no, that didn't work at all. That plan... Uh, I, I feel like I'm gonna have to use bombs there because I see no other way out of that attack. Other than just bombing it. Because I legitimately see nothing else I can do to get out of that. And how long is this gonna go on for? Ah! Ah! Uh, okay. I tried switching it up there, but uh, didn't quite do it fast enough. That thing's just... They just keep firing! How, I, how do I get out of the cycle if there's no opening it to change my direction? Ah! Getting hit by everything now. Ah! Yikes, 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 yikes. Alright. Uh, it's, it's not supposed to be hot in the courtyard. You're hot because you're wearing those heavy clothes. You're hot because you're wearing those heavy clothes. Yeah, I sure am. This is why I wear in winter, you know. Why are you wearing hot clothes in burning heat when it's not even winter time? It's a cat. I wonder if cats love me now. A black cat in the flames of hell. What a bad omen. Ta-da! Hey, sis, you're pretty good. Your strength's growing on me. Hey, is that to Marisa or is that to the actual player? That's what I want to know. What? The cat turned into a person. A cat and a person with the margin of error. Uh. <laughs> oh yeah, sis. You want to find out about that geyser, right? I heard you're talking about it before. I heard you talking about it before. You'd better give up. Yeah, you'd better give up. You have to meet the worst bird ever to stop the geyser. If she touches you, you melt right away, and looking in her eyes will drive you mad. And at now, she's uh, so dazzling you can't see nothing. But, uh, Patch... Uh, Patcholi, what now? You can only keep going, right? Right on past her. If you can't stop the geyser, then something worse will happen. Guess I have no choice. But you're watching from up there. It's really hot down here. I'm just watching. I'm drinking. I'm not just watching. I'm drinking tea while watching. Hey sis, you want to keep going? Or are you going to turn back? I don't want to keep going. Oh, you don't want to keep going? Great. I'll be sure to be gr careful with your strong corpse and spirit when you're dead. Alright. Ah! Alright, let's go. Again, I'm focusing my attacks toward the boss, because I'm pretty sure it's much better to... Okay, it doesn't even matter. Alright, let's go again. But yeah, it takes them out a lot faster when you just... I also gotta try and not focus too much on points. Because points do nothing to benefit your, benefit your extra lives. I'll gladly pick up whatever comes my way, but the only items I really need to focus on is my power. Alright, let's go. Alright, you think you can beat me? Ah! Well, you can cause me to use up some power, but you ain't gonna legitimately beat me. Okay. Ah! 
Ah, oh, why? How did I get scared? Seems I just get scared by everything now. All right, let's go. All right. See if I can evade this attack properly this time. But I do have my hands ready to go for that. No, I failed to properly avoid that attack. Okay, that's one attack I need to work on. As well as um, the next spell card attack. Ah! Okay, this one switched to the widespread. So I can prepare for evasive maneuvers. Okay, that went well. Let's see if I can do it again. Alright, focus specifically on avoiding the bullets at hand. Okay, that maneuver went well. So, let's see here. That's the kind of stuff I need to keep up. So, yeah, having widespread is very useful for that part. Because, yeah, I need to focus specifically on ensuring that... I, I'm hitting the boss as well as, like, you know, making sure I take the time to avoid the projectiles. So having widespread on allows me to focus more on avoiding the projectiles. So that's a useful attack. This is a useful shot type for that attack in particular. Uh oh. Oh, come on! Isn't there going to be an opening to get out? So I specifically wanted out, and it wouldn't let me get out. That is... Well, then again, that is the sailor's way. Um, okay, yeah, there's one more wave. I remember... I remember the little extra wave at the end. Then it stops. Alright. Alright, here we go again. Alright, focus uh, straight forward again. Ah, what hit me there? I was paying attention real carefully there. What hit me there? But oh, how do I keep getting hit there? I'm paying close attention and everything and stuff's hitting me. I, I'm... Oh, I have to press both shift and the fire button to switch. After I let go of both. So, is it like if I... Yeah, okay. Did I forget about that? Alright, let's try this again. But uh, I think this is the first shot type that actually... I mean, outside of the first one I used. But this is the first shot type that makes me feel like it's possible to get past this stage. As long as I uh, pay close attention to everything along with, you know, using my bombs wisely. So this is the first time I actually feel like it's possible. Alright, let's try... I'm going to try something. I think it might be better to try a bit of a back and forth motion here. So that way those streaming attacks aren't capable of cornering me. That's what I'm going to try. A back and forth notion that um, does not appear to be working. Okay, and then go. Focus your attacks specifically on the mid boss. Alright, so I'm only going to move if I absolutely see it move quickly, if I absolutely see myself desperate to get out of here. Other than that, it's totally possible. As I have clearly demonstrated, that it's clearly possible to get through... <sighs> well, what's important is that I showed it was possible. Now, once again... We gotta go into focusing more towards evasive maneuvers. Alright, that went well for the first wave. So we need to get through about three waves of these. Uh, or only two? I thought I needed to do a total of three waves of evasive maneuvers. But yeah, there's got to be a lot more instances like that where I got to focus less on hitting the enemy and more on, you know, avoiding projectiles. 
Otherwise, things are gonna get out of hand. Really quickly. Oh, this attack! Yeah, I don't like this one. I- Ah! Again, Marisa's very bad at fitting through things, because... I don't think I initially died to this attack before, but I did now, thanks to Marisa. Alright, one last wave to surprise me. Which, of course, I saw coming. Alright, no, no, one more wave. Okay, but once again, we're heading into the boss with no extra lives remaining. Alright, again, I'm focusing my attacks towards the boss. And, alright, keep a eagle eye out so I remain I'm gonna remain in a position to where I can focus my attacks towards uh, the boss and then this is where it gets difficult because this is when they start firing all the insanity to where I'm really gonna have to probably start bombing it here so I can focus my attacks specifically towards the boss so I really don't know how to get out of this attack without just bombing it there. Which of course is gonna make things hard for the rest of the fight because now I have um, little power left. All right. All right, I'm doing fairly good. Except I'm not taking her out fast enough. No! I'm just going for it then, because I want those, I need the extra lives that, I forgot about this attack. That, that was a total waste, because I let it all go to waste. Alright, at least leave me in a position to where I can go after that, oh my goodness. There are some instances where this works well and instances where this doesn't work well. I'm definitely enjoying the game a lot more with this, but... Yeah, because compared to previous shot types, this definitely feels better, but at the same time, we're still not really getting anywhere past stage 5. So, we're going to have to figure some things out. So I'm doing well at getting the hand, hang of other stages, but this one I'm still having trouble with. Which is interesting, because I managed to get past this stage on like the first episode, uh, when I first played as Marisa with the shot type Bay. Probably most likely thanks to how powerful Yukari is. But it's like I still have a ways to go with... No. We ain't doing that one. Alright, let's give it one more... I pressed the wrong button. Okay, no, we're done. Alright, well... I definitely enjoyed that shot type, though. Having... A, I, I think this... I, what I like about this is, unlike, you know, where you select your shot type at the beginning of the game, you can switch between a different variety of shot types. Um... At within just like you know a couple of button clicks and get to the one you want but definitely one issue I saw early on was um, ha uh, sometimes taking my attention away from the bullets to switch between the shot type I wanted as well as um, having to as well as you know a lot of things in stage 5 that's are still rough but I'm figuring some things out like that one attack that annoyed me last in the last few episodes, I managed to figure out a good um, way to go about it, all thanks to this shot type. So, uh, yeah, it really helped. So I'm I'm learning, and I definitely still have a long ways to go till I get towards remotely finishing this game. But I'm making progress. That's what's important. I'm learning. I'll know it for next time. But until then. Um, we still have one more ally to check out, and then I'll probably go back to playing as Reimu with the, uh, having Yukari as my ally, since I do want to at least get 
all of the endings to the game in their chrono in their um you know numbered order um the only other al i haven't played as yet is natori kawashiro so we'll see how this shot type works but i'm figuring things out and i'm sure as i continue to figure things out i'll continue to get more powerful so and until then though if you enjoyed this episode make sure to leave a like and subscribe and click the notification bell to stay notified of future uploads and until next time this is the Gamer of Gamers, and stay excellent, everyone!